you wait till the wind is high, and they've busted Antifa and leftists all over the world. Big fires in France right now, big fires in Germany. When the winds get high and it's dry, out come the Re Extinction Rebellion leftists, and they don't like populists. They don't like people having houses. They don't like people having cars. I believe arsonists did set these fires, and we have evidence we'll cover next hour of that and people being arrested for it. What's up, everybody? Major Retired Richard Ojeda here. And so this is staged, but it wasn't done with a laser. Right-wing nut job Alex Jones has reached into his nasty top hat again and pulled out the same old crisis actor rabbit accusations. This is staged, but it wasn't done with a laser even though that's sexy and fun to talk about. It was done with a lighter or matches and gasoline. You can bet your bottom dollar on that. Jones had the audacity to minimize the suffering of folks in Hawaii who have lost everything to allege that the devastating fires were set by Antifa. Jones portrayed the world as having been set ablaze by some unforeseen boogeyman. Big fires in France right now, big fires in Germany. When the winds get high and it's dry, he said, out come the extinction rebellion leftists, and they don't like populists, so they don't like people having houses. Making outrageous accusations and calling victims crisis actors in the midst of human suffering is not new for Jones. Jones was sued for nearly a billion dollars in three defamation lawsuits. He had falsely claimed that the 2012 school shooting in Newtown, Connecticut was a hoax. He was the cruel SOB that confronted families of the victims of carrying on a hoax. And I'm not into arson, and I'm not a pyromaniac, but even if the globalists took all our guns, went to a physical civil war, you can take all the guns you want with a double-edged dagger or a hammer, and you can burn down whatever you want with a can of gasoline and a lighter. We're not doing that. But the left, they've been caught all over the country. And you know what the big tell is of hundreds? You know why I know? Patterns. You know, I know they were going to blow up the World Trade Center with jumbo jets. They were wargaming it. They had the Pentagon cancel a trip a week before to New York, and the list goes on and on. This is the largest natural disaster we've ever experienced, Hawaii's Governor Josh Green said at a Saturday news conference. It's going to also be a natural disaster that's going to take an incredible amount of time to recover from. The Maui wildfires are the deadliest in the United States in more than a century, yet Alex Jones is saying that Antifa is to blame. Why is Alex Jones trying to push this narrative? If you're paying attention to the latest conspiracy sound bites, blaming Joe Biden for a natural disaster is what's trending. Colorado's Lauren Boebert recently accused President Biden of being on vacation instead of responding to the disaster. Democratic activist at Hawaii Delilah tore into Boebert on social media over her idiotic statement, calling her despicable. Jones and Boebert are worthy of sharing a jail cell with their orange lord and savior, Donald Trump. They do nothing except spread outright lies. They both are deserving of an indictment. And that is an absolute fact. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.